Hello, everybody. It's me, Christopher underscore 1993. And today, of course, we are inside Minecraft Bedrock Edition 1.10. That's right. They've released the Village and Pillage. They began to release the next phase of the Village and Pillage update on the Bedrock Edition of Minecraft. Of course, I've already created a showcase world, so I can show you all the new features. Here is the showcase world that I've been working on. So, without further ado, let us uh, begin. Oh, I was in creative mode. So, because they showed up when I, I was, this uh, wandering trader showed up when I first arrived. These, these are only available through experimental gameplay, and they're always accompanied by two trader llamas. The trades will vary depending on the biome, so. Why don't we get ourselves some emeralds? <coughs> yeah, that's... See what happens when we trade. Now, we have to be quick because these, only one will spawn in the world, and, uh, hmm. quite frankly, oh yeah, I was using a command block to create the world as well. So... First things first, uh, they've added shields. They've added shields to the game. We've had them on Java Edition for a long time, and now, and they've added them in, so... <laughs> Added shields in. This now. Unlike Java Edition, in the Bedrock Edition, if, uh, you have to crouch to activate shields. So, uh, we'll move on from the shields. So, uh, we move on to the next feature. Lanterns. Now, previously, in 1.9 Bedrock Edition, they were only available in creative mode. So, uh, 
I just happen to have the uh, crafting recipe. There we go. Now with this, if the top block on the block that is above the lantern is broken, the lantern will fall. Will break as well. Now, another thing that was added, uh, another thing that was added was the campfires. So if we go into game mode, uh, survival, we'll be able to craft it. And we'll have to give ourselves a now, uh, you still cannot, still no functionality with these campfires, but. Get two pieces of coal when you drop them. When you, well, if you break them with silk cuts, you get silk cuts too, you get them back. Alright then. It's, um. over to the next feature. The blast furnace. This is now the crafting recipe for it. To get smooth stone, however, you need to put stone, regular stone through the furnace, so... Okay. If you're in creative mode, I'll show you the crafting recipe. Go. Now, the blast furnace. Now we got to go back into because I have to show you something because I don't believe these have functionality. If we go down here and grab ourselves a hopper and a chest. Uh, let's, uh... This coal for for fuel because this isn't like the Java edition snapshots. See, it hasn't gone through yet. Of course, the blast furnace can smell ores, so we'll have to.
So there's no way because it's functionality for this as well as the smoker crafting recipe here. Oh, and uh, they've now added wood. Sided bark of all the six variants in the game. While we were on the subject of it, but the smoker does not have any functionality. We won't even bother trying, so we'll move on to the next feature. And I do believe the same would apply to the barrel. These are uh, new uh, blocks. I do believe some of them are still only available through experimental gameplay. Campfire, I do believe. Not, and with the shield, I know it. Blast furnace, the smoker, the <laughs> to believe the barrel, which we are about to craft, is still experimental gameplay. Same with the new stone cutter and of course the composter, which we're about to show you all. So, you can't even, let me try and, uh, the functionality for these will come in 1.11. So, same with the, the composter, I do believe. But these have different crafting recipes than Java Edition. So... I know, of course. No functionality yet. Of course, with the stone cutter, which we're about to craft next. Uh, unlike Java Edition, this doesn't have functionality yet. Either. I do believe it's still experimental gameplay. But I do believe they've added crafting recipes. The next two features, which we are about to well, we need to 
clear our hot bar. Need some bone meal. That's a new village. The sweet berries. Now these are experimental gameplay only. And like in the Java edition in Snapshot, it still takes damage. But Do grow with bone meal. Also, a lot of everything has been retextured. All right, let's move on to the next uh, the village. They've got new villages up ahead. So, so if you've seen my Java edition videos, you know that uh, my last snapshot video I did. 19W11A, uh, of course, in this one, barrels have spawned naturally here. Yet, baby villagers don't uh, have the new texture. Oh, and uh, villagers, for some reason, villager outposts seem to spawn near villages. There are no pillagers yet. Of course, that would be for 1.11, uh, I do believe. Of course, the workstations from the previous video. Oh, before we get to the lectern, we need to go back to the sweet fairy to get some more link to eat. Now, the sweet berries are only available through experimental toggle. So, we'll craft the lectern.
Now, with the lectern, as we wrap it up, it uses It will use, I do believe it's the same crafting recipe as the Java edition, but the comparator oops, it right here. In fact, we need to switch to Creative mode. We have to switch to creative mode. If we place it on the lectern, as you can see, there's no comparator output. So, if we, you, let me prove it to you, we got get ourselves a lamp and some dust, redstone. See if it lights up. Nope, there's no redstone functionality for the for the grindstone yet. So I do believe that's gonna wrap it up here for me. So uh, be sure to comment, like, subscribe, and share. Social media links are in the description. So are the links. 2017 and 2018 live streams, Mind Connor's information, Skippy Six Gaming, Nico the Pro, Optifine, Champion Hands, 5357, Neil Mango, Bob, World Painter, Paint.net, Download Forge, Eclipse, Minecraft 1.14 information for the Bedrock, for the Java edition, my old Emerald Armor mod for 1.12, Mount Nova Skin Editor, Color Wheel by Sessions College, Resource Pack Tutorial Video by OMG Craft, Download 7 Zip, MC Metacode, Kuba, the Red Engineer, and his website. Bumba Zumbo, IBX Toy Cat, Ant Venom, Fire Gaming, Blue Smash Crafter, Mr. Crayfish, Phoenix SC, RJ Gaming, Donnie Bones, Logged Out Zip, MC Edit, uh, Mindplex Games, MC Stacker, MVT Explorer, Steppy, Dinner Bones YouTube Channel, Team Mojang's YouTube Channel, OMG Craft, OMG Chat, OMG Crafts, MVT Explorer Video, Green Exploding TNT, Pixie Double, Purple Tip, Avery White Morse Channel, and Website, or Pros, Harry's Tech, Harry Talks, Download OBS and OMG Crafts, OBS Studio Video. Mindplex server IP addresses for US and Europe, the high Mindcage, MC Origins, well, those are for Java Edition server. Minecraft belongs to Marcus, not the person. Mojang, Microsoft, and 4J Studio. All copyright belongs to the respective owners. Used under fair use, not plagiarism. I recorded this using OBS. Link to the Minecraft movie article. Uh, Minecraft.net, Jigabob.net, Mindplex.com, HiveMC.com, MindK.com, PlanetMinecraft.com, Performium.net, TelltaleGames.com, and Hypixel.net. Anyhow, thanks for watching. Bye!